another episode of Hood Games. I'm your host, a 40-year-old gamer, and let's just get right into it, man. Um, we're going to talk about a couple scary games that you should be playing right now. You know, um, games that I'm big. I'm a big fan of. And the first one I'm going to talk about, Resident Evil 6. Resident Evil 6 is a great game, man. It's, um, it's got a good story to it. Um, I heard a lot of people say a lot of bad things about it, but I don't care, man. I liked it personally, you know. Um, you know, I didn't find nothing wrong with it. You know, I, I, you know, a lot of people didn't like it, but me personally, I like Resident Evil 6. I think some people were saying it was too much action-driven rather than story mode, but you know, to me, the story was a good. It was a good story. Um, you know, it's about uh, this guy that basically runs into this woman and the president is already um, turned and he's about to attack the woman and basically you know he has to do what he has to do you know I ain't gonna spoil it for you man but um, this is a good game to play man around this time man I highly recommend Resident Evil 6 for the uh, Xbox 360 man and without further ado let's get into a clip of Resident Evil 6 for the Xbox 360 Bioorganic weapons are a global threat. Start working with the rest of the world. We have to come to my desire to reveal the truth. It might create more problems than time to take responsibility. We want to have any chance. I've always valued your friendship, Leon. Stay right where you are. Mr. President! She's here, somewhere. We'll need to get the elevator working again. It's locked, but I work here. I've got the keys. Once we're in, we can take my car. Thanks. Now let's find Liz and get the hell out of here. Liz? Liz, is that you? already got out. They're waiting for us at home.
How do we get out of this place? The underground parking lot. The elevator is up ahead. Hopefully it still works. Let's get this out of our way. I'm glad you guys were here. believe this. Well, could you... All right, y'all back. Resident Evil 7. Let's get right into it, man. This is a great game, whether you have VR or you don't have VR. It don't matter, man. This is still a great game to play, man. You don't have to have a VR system to play this game. It's just VR compatible. But Resident Evil 7 is pretty much the, the number one horror game to me in my opinion of this year man I rated a 10 out of 10 man and Resident Evil 6 to me gets like a 7 out of 10 because these are great games man these are games I'm playing right now I'm having really, a really good time playing Resident Evil 6 and Resident Evil 7 man and without further ado let's get into a clip of Resident Resident Evil 7 is a great game, but you can go check out my uh, review on it 
I did a, uh, uh, I played it with the PlayStation VR on one of my videos. Go check it out, man. Resident Evil 7 is a great game, man. It's, it's, I highly recommend it, man. It's um, terrifying, man. That's all I got to warn you, man. It's just, it's really, really scary, man. And thank you for watching. Hit the like button if you like the video. Subscribe if you like the channel. And leave a comment at the bottom if you got any comments. And until next time, y'all too old to be playing video games.